Hi lovies, welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, I'll be showing you how I made decorations and giveaway for Alea's baptism party. So before we start, I just want to give a shout out to my friend Ashley. She makes motherhood and lifestyle videos. Awesome channel. So if you like my content, you will definitely like hers too. Go check her out. And I'm going to put her Instagram in the description box too. Let's start. The first DIY was the word bless decoration. I wrote the letters in a the paper. Then after that, I cut them. I used this Amazon box to trace the letters. The reason why I used this paper with letters instead of writing it directly on the cardboard was for them to have the same size and avoiding mistakes. So I laid all the letters in a cardboard, thank goodness it fits, then I traced them. It doesn't have to be perfect as long as you can see the letters properly and they're in same size. And of course, Aleo wants to be involved in this DIY project and to be in the camera. When all the letters were traced, we cut it using cutter, then Andrew painted it with color pink. All the paint that we used were Andrew's. He used to paint a lot before, so we didn't need to buy a new one. When the paint was dry, I add the flowers. I just wrap it around the letters. These flowers look so pretty and we got it from Amazon. Then, using clear strings, I just put holes on top of the letters, then hang it. For the second DIY was the centerpiece. These empty jars were applesauce containers that I didn't dispose. I just cleaned and painted them. When the paint was dry, I added lace fabric 
to look more girly and cute. I had this lace fabric a long time ago. I got it from Amazon as well. If you're new to my channel, hello, welcome, my name is Jill and I have an 8 month old baby girl named Alea. Here in my channel, I make motherhood and lifestyle videos and I do vlogs as well. So if you like those kind of videos, make sure to subscribe and hit that notification bell so you don't miss out. Then I just add fake flowers that we already have at home. We just bought these God bless and cross decoration to be more festive. The third DIY was our giveaway. I used Alea's baby food jar, cleaned and removed the label. Tips for saving money, use what you have and be creative with it. Then I just add some lace fabric in the jar. To be more girly and fun i also added a tiny little bow also got this from amazon i'll try to link everything in the description box For the lid, I painted them with the same paint I used for the centerpiece. Check out my social media account. I post updates, pictures of Alea and her family. And let's stay connected. After the paint is dry, I glued this thank you card on top of the lid. Then I added a little bow to cover those holes on top of the card.
I love chocolates. So I already have these pink kisses at home and put handful of them in the jar. And that looks so cute and very affordable. And for the last DIY was the cookie stand. I got this platter and small containers from Dollar Store. I don't want the platter laying flat on the table, so I come up with the idea to put legs on them. I just removed the lid from the small container, then glued it on the bottom of the platter. So that's pretty much it for today's video. I hope you like it. Give this a thumbs up if you do. Consider subscribing to my channel and hit that notification bell so you'll be notified every time I post a video. If you have mommy video suggestions, leave it in the comment section and to be featured on my comment of the day. Salamat at mahal ko kayo and I'll see you in my next video. Bye!